What is up family? Jordan Cador here and welcome to today's video. Today we are at the gym about to go in and hit some legs. So I've been doing these videos where I kind of just show y'all every day's workouts. So it's nothing crazy. I've been doing voiceovers today. We might switch it up a little bit. The problem is right now the gym is absolutely slammed with college kids as I mentioned yesterday. So I'm doing my best and working with the angles that I can and trying to get some cool clips, but really it's kind of like whenever I can just set up my camera and go with it, that is what I'm doing. I've even been doing a couple extra sets on some of it because of this, but I am sore. As I mentioned yesterday, we are starting the cut. So I started the workouts this week. Uh, I changed up the workouts on Monday for the cut and I just switched up the diet starting yesterday, but I am super sore. I actually am enjoying how sore I am because it's in my back and my chest, which chest I hit two days ago. So the fact that I'm still as sore as I am is pretty gnarly and I am loving it. That's that I, I do enjoy that aspect of it. Uh, the bodybuilding side is a different type of soreness than it is when you're just heavy lifting. That is more in the joints than it is in the muscles but progress is being made so oh new beanie let me know what y'all think word of the day we're gonna start doing word of the days word of the day is blue beanie so that's two words but we're gonna make it one hashtag blue beanie you feel me um but yeah we're at the gym and we're about to go smash some legs there's the gym i don't know if y'all can see it dirty dirty window maybe but yeah so i'm not gonna go heavy today just gonna break down the muscles really working on some size and not getting injured so yeah make sure you throw a thumbs up make sure you subscribe let's go get this work and today's leg workout started off with some hack squats not very strong at this movement, haven't done them very long. Only been doing them about a year ago when I started doing more of the bodybuilding style training. So I did about five sets here, <clears throat> anywhere from eight to 15 reps. The first two sets I did closer to the 15 reps. Last couple sets I did closer to the eight reps. Knocked over the Healy mix though. I apologize, the cup's so strong though, didn't even phase it, so. Make sure you get one, use code the flex. Same with that Rise pre-workout bottle. Let's get back to the workout though. Going full depth here. Sometimes I won't go full depth, keep the quads a little more activated, but I was planning on doing regular squats today. I wasn't actually planning on doing these hack squats, but all the squack, squat, squack all the squat racks were taken so we improvised <clears throat> try not to stress things like that and it confuses the muscle a little bit so i uh, i don't mind switching the movement slightly when i walk in and the machine is taken as you can see this 315 here is a struggle for me again mad props to the guys that are you doing 405 and 495 on this like it's nothing. I'll get there one day, baby. I will get there one day. So since we pushed a little bit of weight on the hack squats, the next movement I wanted to be more reps and very lightweight. <clears throat> this bag here is only 37 pounds. So for me, I might as well not even have any weight to be honest, but that is the highest weight they go with on these bags and they're very convenient for lunging. You can see the quad pump here is ridiculous. And it's only about to get worse because the next movement is going to be leg extensions. I actually do love some leg extensions. I know some guys hate on them and say they are bad for the knees, but you know what? <clears throat> they haven't caused me any problems yet. And I don't feel any knee, any knee pain when I do them or after I do them. So I'm going to keep rocking with them because I love them. I feel like I get a great contraction when I do these and it just gives me some good mind muscle connection. <clears throat> And you can see there, boom, looking juicy. Blood flow was going right about now. Let's go, baby. I do try to squeeze on the last set for three to five seconds. On to some leg press. Didn't go very heavy here. We're doing anywhere from eight to 12 reps. Good controlled reps. Until the last set, you will see I'm kind of cranking them out and I'm not going down as far. What I do that for is to push blood flow and just really get a nice pump. Look at them veins though. Looking juicy, looking juicy. But yeah, I think uh, next clip, <clears throat> nope, there it is. There's those reps, so that's it. Again with the veins, you can see going much faster than we were. We did hit one shoulder movement off some cables. Shoulders are a big weakness of mine, so I've been trying to add an extra movement in or two a week. But this is going to wrap up the workout. 
I did a little bit of cardio when we got done, went home and ate some chicken and rice like a true bodybuilder. But thanks for watching. And that is going to wrap up today's workout. I am back home now, obviously. I wanted to hit some posing after this workout, but the mirror room was taken up by a class, so unfortunately that did not happen. Um, what else am I supposed to say? Oh, don't forget, if you do like the blue beanie, today's word of the day is blue beanie. Make sure you comment it down below. And let me know if y'all are liking these voiceovers. I know it's a little bit different from the normal videos I've been putting out, but this does allow me to put out more content. A lot of you have been saying I've been grinding and putting out more content. To be honest, these videos are just so much easier to put out. Very little editing. Um, that will change a little bit as I get better at it. And there's just not so many people in the room and I can hit y'all with all all those angles so if you made it this far obviously you need to like subscribe as always y'all i will see y'all in the next video much love